it's a very small kitchen. But <laughs> you have a very large kitchen. <laughs> I'm very jealous of your kitchen. It's the only thing I didn't like about this house that it was like really small and it's an alleyway, so it's just there. Anyway, so we need a few things first to start off. A plate for our bread, uh, a butter knife, simple things. We need some cheddar cheese oh, in nice butter. thin slices. And then we need some tomato as well, also in thin slices. Oops, I'm not very good at slicing tomato, obviously. Uh, we need a little bit of margarine. This is Australian margarine. And we of butter. course, we need Vegemite. Oh, perfect, it's a little baby one. <laughs> <laughs> and of course, the last thing you need is just bread. Whatever kind of bread you want. I've got white bread because I'm unhealthy. <laughs> <laughs> so it's, it's a real preference thing about whether you toast your bread or not. I'm going to because the bread that we've got is not that great and it kind of rips apart a little bit. We toasted um, ours. Yeah. Oh, okay. He's way ahead of me. I'm running a bit <laughs> late because Tom and sleep and all that stuff. So... Okay, so the... I'm ready to open this. <laughs> definitely open it. Open it up, sniff, uh, get a real taste for it. Oh, it smells beautiful. It gives you goosebumps, this. It's like when you first open a salt and vinegar packet and you sniff it. <laughs> it, smells like a, it smells like a bouillon cube. I don't know what that is, but yes. Don't you think it smells like bouillon? No. Oh, it smells oh. like deliciousness. Oh, it's oh. definitely not Marmite because Marmite smells and tastes like shit. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> whoopsie, like it's not it good stuff. Like <laughs> I'm done. So, um, my bread won't be a sec. So I'm just going to turn up my volume a bit. Tom has finally fallen asleep, thank goodness. Yeah. <laughs> um, so... With the amounts that you get, I've obviously been eating it since I was like two months old. Like it's just, it's a staple in Australia. Everybody eats it. It's really, really good for hangovers. So if you have a hangover, grab a teaspoon full of it and just shove it in your mouth because of all the vitamin B that's in it. But um, what you want to do, get in there and get about, about that much. So that's good. Is that how much you normally get? I would get more than that. Okay. Um, so this is probably. We want to eat it like you're telling us, and then we want to try it like you do. Oh, okay, fair we'll enough. Do both. We'll so do this both. will do two slices of bread. Okay. So you really just want to have it you know, mm. on really quite thin. My toast is kind of slow. Baby <laughs> speed. Okay, so we've got our toast. Uh, we want to start just doing it backwards for you. want to start with some margarine or butter with whatever you've got and, like, just lather that on. So we lather it on really thick with, with margarine or butter. And just be really kind of sloppy with it. It doesn't need to be perfect because you just going to get the mayonnaise. Just going to mix it up with everything. So then, grab your amount of uh, Vegemite. So you want to do about that much for two um, bits of bread. And that's quite a lot. So definitely do it quite thin. So what you want to do with your bread, you just want to spread it and then scrape it. So we want to spread it so it's kind of like that, but we want to make it, if you were thinking about stockings, they'd be fishnet stockings worth of Vegemite. So you can see through it and you can see the margarine in there and really kind of get it into the margarine as well and mix it up with that margarine. So that's the kind of consistency that you want there. We've already messed up because we did our Vegemite first, but... I'm sure it'll taste That's okay. That was my fault. <laughs> <laughs> so 
So, have a go at that. Right. Take a bite of that. There we go. Mm. Salty. There's no look of disgust, so that's a good mm. start. It's not bad. Strong at the end. It does have a real mm. salty kind of taste to it. <laughs> I might like it. You <laughs> might like it. You yeah. love it. You know you'll love it. <laughs> <laughs> I really thought it was going to be disgusting. I think well, by the way that um, Greg and Derek on d and Cruises did it, I thought that everybody would hate it, but I think maybe they did it a bit too thick. I do like them. That's good. <laughs> See, we can be friends forever. <laughs> I give it a thumbs up. That's good. So, the next thing that we're going to do is we're going to add some cheese into it. Um, so you've got your second piece of bread. Um, have your margarine on it again and don't go as thick with the margarine or butter this time. Um, you do want to put a bit more uh, Vegemite on this time. Okay. So, I'd probably go about that amount. This is more how much I would do. Um, so this would be quite a bit stronger for you. But we will have the cheese and tomato on there to mix into it as well. We're going for it. <laughs> so just slather that on again. And you just want to think of like spiderweb, spiderweb stockings, but then a little bit tighter top on it, if that makes sense. So you want to look at about that consistency. Okay. So then... You've got your slices of cheese. Now, I've done them quite thin because just that's what we do. You can have them as thin or as thick as you like because cheese is awesome. Yeah, I love cheese. She don't like cheese. I love cheese. Oh, that cheese is so good. Okay, I have to give good. up cheese, which is really quite sad, but I love cheese. So have a go at that one. Just cheese, Vegemite, and have a go. Have a go at this. That's a little stronger. <laughs> oh, it got better. You do? Oh, yeah. It's, oh, good. it's so good. Um, so the creaminess of the cheese should be mixing with the saltiness of the Vegemite. And, it, oh, it's just, oh, so good. <laughs> Doesn't that just give you goosebumps? <laughs> yeah, that's awesome. That's my favorite. So good. So the next one that we're going to do I'm just going to reuse my um, my sandwich with the um, cheese on it because we're going to go cheese and tomato. So the tomato there again just adds another layer to it all. Um, and a lot of people call these the red belly, uh, what is it, the red back spider sandwich. So Australia yeah. has got a sandwich called the red, uh, sorry, Australia's got a spider called the red back spider that's got red on it. And this is often called the red back spider. Mm -hmm. So cheese, tomato, and Vegemite. There right, we go. That's really good. There we go. Our tomato's juicy. That's good. Mm. That one's good. Mm -hmm. mm. And that tomato That's just good. takes away some of the sting of the Vegemite. <clears throat> and oh, that's the best, isn't it? Now, other people do know. add like fried eggs onto the red back spider sandwich, and that is really, really That's good. True. But my chickens have stopped laying, so I've got no eggs whatsoever. Um, <laughs> I can see that. Oh, DG's oh, got to do this again. Oh, yeah. <laughs> DG, honestly, I don't think they did it properly right. because they didn't enjoy it. And if you don't enjoy it, you're just not doing it properly. <laughs> Very unhealthy. <laughs> yeah. yeah very good. So the last one I'm going to do is just how I would spread it. Um, so I'm just going to do this just on a plain piece of bread. So she, she can cake it on. 
So again, I do my margarine. And it's awesome. Once you put your bread knife into like <laughs> Vegemite, there's always some left over. <laughs> Those look extra in there. Yeah, look, it's like an extra surprise. <laughs> <laughs> so then... Our Vegemite tin's getting empty and that's really quite sad. So I would do about that much for one. <laughs> but, I mean, I have been eating it forever. Um, it may be a bit strong. But you've always got your cheese and tomato there to take it down if you need to. So for this one, I don't mix in with the margarine. I just put it straight over the top and it's like a full coverage. So that there is a full coverage Vegemite sandwich. There it is. And then that is the perfect way to do it. Plain bread, plain margarine, bread. Vegemite. Margarine, Vegemite. Try it. But some margarine. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's so good. <laughs> Is that a bit strong for you? <laughs> you like I'm home. This one's this one's too strong, I think. So that's I think that's where most people go wrong. Is that they okay. do spread it like it's jam, and it's not it's jam. Good on him. Shove the whole thing in his mouth. Good work, Ronnie. I'm all about this baby mate. <laughs> right he mouth. only complains when he walks. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> this one's good though with the tomatoes. That's good. All right, everybody yes. else is gonna mess up because they don't yeah. know how to do it. <laughs> um, it's all about the right consistency. You have to kind of build yourself up to the bigger ones, unless you're like running and you're like, "Oh, I can take it." <laughs> <laughs> I like it. It's oh, I love that you like it. it. Yeah, I didn't know. I don't think it's gonna be that good. You can be an honorary Australian any day. It was very, <laughs> very good. The I cheese enjoyed. and the tomato. I think I like just the cheese. I think that was my favorite. Yeah. And then uh, the one with the tomato is good too. But I, I think um, I like the one with the tomato because it puts that little bit of freshness in there and it makes you feel like you're trying to be healthy. <laughs> 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 exactly. But yeah, I, I like to win the cheese. That's one that's great. Thank you so much. And they're all gonna mess up. We're gonna be the only ones that like it, I bet you. Oh yeah. And like <laughs> I say, if they if they don't like it, they're just doing it wrong. It's that's not right. and we're gonna tell them. So. Yeah. Well we're telling them now because they're gonna be playing this. <laughs> they are doing it wrong. Don't do it wrong. And oh my gosh, I'm gonna be watching do. this. I'll be watching everyone do it wrong and I'll be sitting there saying, don't insult Australia. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. We appreciate you doing it with us. I, I think we might actually finish our little baby jar. I reckon you should. Does and then you should order another one. Sorry? Do we put it in the refrigerator after? No, or no refrigerator. Just, just, Straight just to the pantry. Okay. Um, if you put it into the refrigerator, it just makes it too hard to spread. Um, and then it'll rip up your bread. Um, so definitely into the pantry, and it's awesome. Thank you so much. That's okay, guys. Have a great day. Bye.